Welcome back, guys. I'm Mike. And I'm Stephanie. And we're Van Life Sheldon's Travels. Sheldon, he's our yellow belly slider turtle. Like always, he's in his tank swimming around. But today we are in Past Christian, Mississippi. Wow, I, I almost had that one, guys. But uh, that was an easy one. Too. It was an easy one, too. But we, you know, we stayed at that spot. And the police circled us a couple times, so we enjoyed the beach and everything. And then we we came here after dinner to a Walmart. Yeah, but this Walmart is very interesting because it's right across the street from the beach. So this is actually like a Walmart with beachfront property, beachfront access. Yeah, so that's new to us. Yeah, so we got here last yeah uh, two days ago in the evening around 9:30, 10. Uh, went in the stores and of course, you know, this virus thing, I'm not going to say the name of it, but uh, it cleared, it's everywhere. yeah, I it's mean, cleared out the shelves everywhere. and when everything. We were in Louisiana, you started seeing it there, Mississippi, you see it here. You know, like Mike was saying, it's not just one area. Like if a hurricane came over, it's the whole country. So we went in, got some supplies, spent an extra 70 bucks that we normally wouldn't spend. But you got to be kind of prepared. I, I'm not be panicking, but just a little bit. Make sure you got an extra one of all the things you I normally use. I think we use. have enough stuff in the van for a month, so yeah. we didn't go crazy. No. But we do, no, we do usually keep about like a week and a two half. And a two week, weeks. Two weeks worth. So we got another two weeks worth. Exactly. So, so we are carrying a little bit A little more bit than extra usual. than normal. But, you know, yesterday we stayed here all day. We went in and asked. They said, no problem. You can stay here a couple nights. No big deal. So we went over here to the beach yesterday. We didn't record. It was windy and took Sheldon over there. And he was all freaked out about the, about the birds. birds and yeah. stuff. But so we didn't record. But we, had, we went and got a pizza last night inside and cooked it in the oven. And just enjoyed being here. I uh, watched our shows last night because they had good TV service here. But uh, today we're going to head over. We got a package that's coming in. So we got it going to a postal place that we pay five bucks to pick it up. Yeah. And there's gas over here for $1.91. Yeah. So we're going to get some gas. We're going to go pick up our package. And then you never know what we're going to get into. So. Just follow along with us and we'll figure it out together, guys. Yeah, let's see what we can get into. Mississippi right here. guys when we were up there towards Gulfport and Port um, Past Christian Past Christian the gas was 191 but look guys 185 right here in Paluxy Mississippi I'll turn the camera around so you can see the city limit sign right there it says Biloxi Mississippi 185 at the shell guys well we're gonna get out of here I just pulled over to show you guys that well we stopped right here after getting that gas and a drink made our way right here to the beach yeah. and Steph made a little uh, grilled cheese sandwich on the camp chef for me I did. 
Yeah, that looks, looks nice. Good. And I wanted to say one of the extra precautions we're taking is using styrofoam plates and bowls because usually we'll use hot water or soap or sometimes if it's just a sandwich we'll even use a Clorox wipe to use our dishes. But now because those things are kind of getting limited like soap is hard to find and Clorox wipes are hard to find so now we're kind of being more skimpy on those things that we have. And so, I don't normally like paper plates or styrofoam plates because they, you know, just a lot of trash. But for the virus thing, we're doing that for now. Got some blueberries. And Steph made her blackberries. And Steph made her a salad for lunch. Oh, nice big Caesar salad. All right. And, and look out the window. This is where we're hanging out today. And we'll bring you guys out there later. Yep. Check it out. Isn't that nice? Wow, right here, free parking. So we're going to enjoy lunch and we'll go outside. Well, after finding another free parking spot right here on the beach, I tell you what, it's pretty nice not to have to pay to park on the beach and so much nice beach here to enjoy. But Yeah, plenty of space for everyone. Yeah, so let's flip the camera around. Walk down here to the beach, guys. Hang out for a little bit. Definitely. Let's see what we can get into. Harris County Sand Beach. That's why we're not bringing Sheldon. It says no animals. Looks like you can rent chairs and umbrellas and jet skis and all kinds of stuff here. But there's plenty of beach here that doesn't have any of that. But right here it works. As you saw yesterday, they had fire pits. No, I didn't talk about it. Did he have fire pits over here you can rent? I don't know if you can rent them or they just give them to you free. But you got to make a appointment with the uh, a reservation with the park service. Again, we brought our little towel. It's come in handy a lot, guys. Beautiful water. Steffi looks pretty. Everybody hanging out. Volleyball. Well, guys, I think... After we hang out here for a little bit, we're gonna try to hit up an Applebee's. They got a little special deal. We'll sh share that when we get there, but it's just nice sitting on the beach, isn't it, babe? Most definitely. One of our favorite places is to be on the beach. All right, just relaxing. We decided to get a couple drinks before the food comes out. Looks good. Well, guys, the food is out. Looks good. We got a couple Long Island iced teas to drink. They have them for a dollar right now at Applebee's. Wings are good. I got the honey uh, mustard or the honey, honey barbecue. barbecue. 
And we got some fries. She's gonna bring out some more. And I got the original, this buffalo. Long Island iced tea. Good deal. Dinner, dinner, dinner. With the tomato? No tomato.